I'm going to cut my hair again. <laughs> So we all know I had a mullet and here is a little hair update. Yeah, it grew into this. I really don't like this part anymore and as you can see these parts are still small. And I'm having the urge to have a bob. This is a thing about me. If I had the urge to do something, especially regarding hair, I would definitely do it. No questions asked. And it has been proven a lot of times. I've had a bob maybe like a year ago and I'm going to insert a picture right here and as you can see my curls are intact and look at this mess right now it's just wavy and I don't know I'm kind of pissed about that because I really like my curls and I really hope that if this part to grow out I will get my curls back because because the thing about my hair is this is the only part that has curls and this and this hair underneath is just waves. So I'm excited to grow this part. And if everything comes out great today, I hope that I will look like this. I'm going to wet my hair, because why not? My hair is dry as fuck. So I am not taking good care of it anyway, so I am not surprised. I am tired of this hair. Well, if I don't feel cute about something, especially hair, you better as I'm going to change it. Like, why would I settle for something that I don't feel good in? I'm going to cut right about that, I guess. About an inch or so. Well, if you're watching this, how are you? This past few weeks have been shit. Well, I am not blaming my hair, of course, but I feel like if I let go of my hair, I am going to let go of my problems. I am a dramatic bitch, of course. Bye-bye! It's crazy how hair affects our life. It will change your look and it will change how you feel and it will change how you view life and it will change how you act. Well, basically it will change your entire life. That's why I'm deciding to change my life today. From my last hair cutting video, I really like how this part flare out and now I hate it. Like, if we're going to curl, why don't you curl inwards? Oh, you see that? We're going to cut it at that length. I miss having long hair, I miss having curly hair, but there's really nothing we can do about that. Oh, also I'm going to color my hair soon. I'm not going to tell the color yet because surprise I don't know how to cut my hair because if I cut it in front it's going to be uneven but that's fine what's the point of doing something if you're not going to regret it it's crazy how we've been here in this pandemic for a whole year now well I mean on lockdown I'm going to insert a picture of me right here from last year. As I was reflecting this past few days about this lockdown and shit, because it's been a year, it's... It... And I'm like, hey, I have a journal, why don't I check that out since I write there literally every day, so... I'm going to read you an excerpt from last year. Okay, this is... March 16, 2020. I'm filming this at March 19. So literally one year and three days. It's almost 1 a.m. Like right now, it's 1 a.m. I film literally at the most odd times. And I'm about to cry myself to sleep. I'm a fucking mess. <laughs> Nothing happened, but here I am being dramatic as fuck. As you should. I've been too nice to myself for a real long while and I think it's stupid. Why would I think that it's stupid? I have a lot of dreams yet here I am doing nothing. Do I really think I can achieve that just by sitting? Maybe they are right. Maybe I'm a worthless girl who don't care about anything but vanity. Why am I so hard with myself? I want to get away from this shithole. I want to get away from here. There is no pressure but everything seems suffocating. I hate it here. Please save me. <laughs> I got you bitch, I'm going to save you. I'm just tired. When will this end? Please. 
I hope when I reread this again, I'm in a much more better place because maybe that's the only thing left to do. To hope. I'm such I'm such a dramatic mess, and I may have had a breakdown about that twice because I am not in a much better place. I am still in a place that I am last year. But I have to keep reminding myself that I am where I'm supposed to be right now. The thing is, I've been deep on my self-care journey at the time, the time that I wrote that. And you see, self-love self journey is not all highs. No matter how much you love yourself, I feel like there is going to be times that life will beat you down. But that's okay because you're going to save yourself again and again and again and again. And I'm just here to remind you that don't get tired of yourself. You're worth it. Maybe I'm just telling myself that, whatever. I feel like this side is much shorter than this side. Should I cut my bangs? Of course I should. And if you can see me that I'm progressively sweating, it's because the weather decided to match me today. So both hot. We're approaching the summer month. I don't know if it's already summer, but it's been so damn hot. That's why I'm filming at literally 1 a.m. because the temperature is, is just a little bit colder, but still not enough. And I don't want to turn my fan on because I've made that mistake multiple times and I had to delete a lot of videos because of that. See, I really like the sound of this. That's the thing about me though, one day I will feel like complete shit, but the other day I will walk the earth like I'm the queen of the motherfucking world, as I should. Because I am. And today is one of those days, as you can see. I am feeling myself, I'm having a good makeup day. You can't deny that I look cute. Even if this hairstyle turns out shit, at least I'm pretty and I can pull it off. My hair, my face is full of hair. I was about to say my hair is full of face. I'm going to try to show you what the back side looks like. I have, I don't know yet. How does it look? Is it even? I highly doubt it, but we're going to run with it. This side is not much shorter than this side. <laughs> okay, so I know it looks uneven as fuck and it will look like that throughout this whole clip. So just a heads up in case this is driving you nuts. I am pretty confident with myself that if I style this correctly, it will look like they're the same blank. So yeah, don't worry about it. It doesn't seem even, but when I stretch it like this, yeah, it's still a lot shorter. <laughs> I don't know what point I'm trying to prove here, but we're going to a little bit more I don't know what will I look like after I wash this and style this but I'm going to show you tomorrow because there is no way in hell that I'm going to style my hair right now I feel so pretty right now this is what it looks like when it's not tucked in <laughs> I look like a freaking coconut <laughs> Keep that in. I hate how this part is flared out and this one is caved in. Is that a proper term? I have hair in my eyes. I am going to see it tomorrow. And oh my gosh. Oh my god! I dropped my phone! I hate it when that happens. If the transition didn't work, I'm going to be mad. Anyways. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something about her features. You'll find the beauty goes much deeper once you get to meet her. You 
see you walking down the boulevard this is what it looks like now i personally think that it looks so damn great i look freaking hot and i'm sweating my balls off right now because <sighs> so hot like stop it i feel like my response for everything nowadays is that i'm hot procrastinated it's okay i'm hot accidentally spent five hours on tiktok it's okay i'm hot my sleepy schedule was fucked up <laughs> Because I am. Okay, let's get back to hair. I personally think that it looks amazing. It looks great. I literally can pull off everything. Like, give me long hair, short hair, curly hair, straight hair. I forgot what I'm going to say. Oh, do you want to know why I look fantastic and everything? Because I'm confident. Like, when you finally gain that confidence, you look great in everything automatically. There's there's no argument about that. Phenomenal in every single look. And if you're going to argue with that, you're just going to be wrong. So like just cut it out. <laughs> I literally can't stop looking at myself in the mirror because if you were me, you'd do the same. Let's get back to the hair again because I keep getting sidetracked by my own beauty. As you can see, there's like a random curl over here. So yeah, that's it for today's video. It's about my hair again. Is it ever going to stop? I don't think so because I'm going to color my hair soon. I feel like I already told that. But I'm going to tell it again. I'm going to color my hair soon. So yeah, I'll see you again at my next video. Bye-bye. Okay, bye.